All right, all right. I normally don't make videos, but after downloading Windows 10 and uh, noticing that there were some features that I was used to that are uh, noticeably absent in the default settings of Windows 10, I thought I'd make uh, a few videos just to help some people out who might be experiencing some of the same issues. Um, to begin with, you'll notice that uh, on the screen, normally if you try to pull up a uh, if you basically try to um, go to a field where you expect a a keyboard to, to pop up like this, um, that, that that basically doesn't happen as part of the default. Um, you have to actually go down here and click on it to bring it up. Um, that's because um, your computer is still on desktop mode, especially if you have one of these hybrid uh, PC tablets. If you're if you're trying to bring that up. Um, it's not going to happen. So what you really need to do here is you need to go over here to your start button, which is at the bottom left hand corner. Uh, you click on that and you bring up the settings and we go to display notifications power and then you basically go over to tablet mode. Um, and when you go to tablet mode, you have to actually turn this, uh, this uh, button on. Um, and this is to make Windows more touch friendly when using your device as a tablet. Um, so basically, once you once you click on that, um, you'll be able to bring up your keyboard again whenever you type into a field that expects some sort of a keyboard input. There you go. So now you can see that the keyboard comes up whenever you uh, try to 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 get in one of these fields that uh, requires a keyboard input. Okay. Um, so let's bring up. Uh, uh, the Edge Explorer here. Um, so if you actually go here now and you try to uh, input something, you'll actually bring up the, the keyboard screen. So one other thing that you'll notice is that um, as, part of, as part of enabling your device to function in a touch-friendly mode for tablets, um, the Metro tiles that were in Windows 8 uh, now appear. Um, unfortunately, that's just sort of the give and take with it. Um, if you're in tablet mode and you want to enter um, information in the fields and have your keyboard automatically come up, then this Metro screen here is usually there. Normally, you can turn this on or off, and I'll, I'll show you how to do that in another video. Um, but once you enable that tablet touch-friendly mode, um, these, these, icons will, these, these icons and tiles um, will come out, and unfortunately, um, I haven't found a way to get rid of them. Okay, uh, thank you, and hope you tune in for another one of my videos.